And I'm not leaving this stage until I have you two no. on my team. No. Tell me something, girl. Are you happy in that modern world? Or do you need more? Is this something else you're searching for? I'm falling In all the good times I find myself wrong For change And in the bad times I feel myself Tim. Hi, Tim. And we're from Melbourne. <laughs> when I was seven, I started training gymnastics. I was doing 32 hours a week. My main goal was to be going to the Olympics. I was doing a training drill on a trampoline and my legs literally came over my head. I just heard my back crunch. I couldn't breathe. Dad has always been there to support me. I ended up finishing up with gymnastics because I did injure my back quite badly. But I'm glad I did in the end because I found singing. I'm going home. My name's Caitlin. And I'm Tim, and we're dad and daughter from Melbourne, Victoria. I'm going home. Music's something that definitely brings us closer together and speak about a lot of things that maybe your average father and daughter won't really talk about. Yeah. Dad was in quite a dark space for quite a while. I went through a marriage breakdown, which was hard. That's when Caitlin became my, my little rock. So grateful that I have a dad that is willing to come on this massive journey with me because I wouldn't be here <laughs> without him. <laughs> oh, this gets emotional <laughs> stuff. <laughs> We are singing Shallow by Bradley Cooper and Lady Gaga. It is the love song, but for me, it's a father's love for a daughter. I just really want the coaches to hear through our singing, our relationship and our connection. My thing is going to be keep my emotions intact. It really means a lot today to actually get out there and turn a chair. You guys are going to make me cry in a minute. Are you OK, Dad? Oh, yeah, <laughs> yes, I am. I'm better now, I'm better now. It's, it's pretty special what we just witnessed. Yeah. And as you know, this is, this is a world first. And you guys are at the level where you could win this. You could be the very first winners of Voice Generations. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and we've only all got one spot left. And, and I think it's going to be a very lucky coach that gets you guys. I mean, it it's just must feel amazing singing with your dad. It is. Honestly, like, I don't, like, don't know many people that can do what we do and it's honestly a blessing to be able to just, no matter what scale it is, whether it's like a pub or something like yeah, this, yeah. just to be able to do this with him is amazing. Yes. Really yeah. good. Awesome. My, um, <laughs> my dad, he rocks in a way as well, he, but, but he's a geologist, so it's a different sort of... <laughs> that's, that, that's my dad joke for the night. Hello, Sorry. And it's a dad joke too. That's a good dad joke. <laughs> there you go. 
I loved it, absolutely loved it. And I, it, it was such a good song choice because lyrically it's perfect for this and what you guys are doing right now. But also it's just such a great showcase for your vocal <laughs> skills. It was really great for that. And your voices blend together beautifully. I got so emotional, I think, and I think you guys did too. You know, that's what it's about. It's about connecting, and that's what this song is about, and you guys really did that, and you connected, and, and you both got on so well vocally together, and, I mean, for me, this is the reason why I've come back to Australia. <laughs> and I would be honoured to have you on Team Rita, absolutely honoured. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. I felt that strong connection between you both, and. My dad, um, when he first realised that I had something, this ability to perform, he went out of his way to, you know, get me to that moment, to every audition, you know, he blood, sweat and tears. Even though he didn't even have any money, he borrowed money and yeah. he made sure that I, that I was up there um, and he put me first. And I feel like there's been a bit of a flip, you know, in my life where, you know, I'm now taking care of my dad, you know, and I, I'm grateful, I'm forever <laughs> grateful. Yeah, so, so, watching, so watching you two, you know, I see that connection, that love, that bond, mm. um, and that, you know, you've done so much for each other, and to land on this stage and perform like that was absolutely outstanding. Nothing like it. Yes, yes. On this show. I've never seen anything like this performance on this Thank show. Thank you so much. Oh, my God. You're right, mm. looking after them now, there's, yeah. there's nothing better. And I think that's, the, that's what's so good about this, this bond. You're both really looking out for each other. It's so amazing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And I'm not leaving this stage until I have you two no. on my team. Oh. No. Them's fighting words. Oh, I love it. I'm fighting for you guys. I need you, Yo. Team Rita. Hey, Come I'm on, fighting. I too. need you guys to be on this wait, team. Wait, wait, wait. Where are you going? I'm getting on my knees. Is what I'm doing. Don't get on your knees. What's going on? Please. Hey, I can do this too. I can do this too. <laughs> So, Caitlin started this, so I'm going to let her... Let me? Let okay. Me. <laughs> <laughs> I think um, the coach we're going to go with tonight is Rita. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my goodness. You have absolutely made my whole life right now. Oh my so goodness. much. Hi. 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 This battle's between my incredible father and daughter duos, Micah and Morris, my R&B pop sensation with incredible dance moves, and Caitlin and Tim, my emotive vocalists. I don't know how, but you know, I've obviously ended up with two incredible duos, <laughs> father and daughters, which is so crazy to me because I think I am don't tell my mum this, even though I've just told the whole world. But my, uh, I'm a daddy's girl, really. <laughs> Should we find out what songs uh, I've got for you both? Yes. Yeah. Caitlin and Tim, we have a really special song for you. It is Say Something by Great Big World, featuring Christina Aguilera. <laughs> I yeah. love that song. Is that all right? Love it. It's such an emotional song, so we're just so happy that we've got the chance to be able to show our connection. It's such a well-known song. It's always important to make it your own. You know, like, they've got their little dance break, and it's great. I want that moment for you both as well. Yeah. yeah. Like, for example, if you, when you do the hook... Say something, I'm giving up on you. Then it's... Oh, just to make it your own a little bit. Say something, I'm giving up on you. Say something, I'm giving up on you. <laughs> that was so great. <laughs> wow. <laughs> that was amazing. You both were so amazing. Wow. That was amazing. I have goosebumps. Um, okay, so I think for me, 
<laughs> this is so nice to see. <laughs> and I miss my dad's school. Oh. <laughs> you know, hearing them and seeing them perform, it really took me back to missing my, my dad. And, you know, I haven't been home for a while, and it really made me feel like, actually, like, he was right there. It's, uh, it's just so nice to have this memory. You guys are going to love this forever. You're going to be able to watch this forever. God, oh, it's so good. So, you know, even though it is, at the end of the day, a competition, you know, I really want you both to just try and enjoy yourselves and make this a moment to remember. This is going to be an amazing, epic dad and daughter duel. Say something, I'm giving up on you. You've got tears in your eyes, and they've, they was there the whole way through that performance. To help, to help your daughter achieve one of her biggest goals and dreams is, is mind-blowing. So, yeah, and just, yeah. Very proud, very proud, man. Yeah. That's great. And I have to ask you too, Morris, what do you think of your little girl? Oh, man, she's a bit of a boss, this one. <laughs> Dad, get in line. Where's that stab? Dad, your note. No, but, um... You know, just as a dad, let alone the, the dance and all that, it's an honour to be the father of this child. She's pretty amazing, super talented, just a beautiful heart, so, yeah. The connection and relationship that you have is so special, and it just reminds me so much of my relationship with my dad, you know, and it's, it's so interesting because I didn't plan to have dads and daughters, and I think the universe was sort of like, you know what we're going to do, mm, Rita? Mm. We're just going to have these <laughs> two individuals and, and, and to come and remind you. So I think you reminded me to call my dad a bit more. So thank you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. I wanted you both to really shine with what was special about both of you, and I think you've done that well tonight, so well done. Rita, it's time. Who won the battle? So, so vocally, you know, you've both delivered. But there was one act that gave me a fraction of bit of more power and more emotion than the other. So, based off what I just witnessed, the winner of this battle is... Caitlin and Tim. Caitlin and Tim, you're going to the Voice Generation's grand finale. Congratulations. Thank you so much. I'm really excited to be able to see you both again and to be able to just hone in on what I feel makes you guys just so special. So, to help with that, a little magician came to me and gave me some photos of you both. <laughs> yeah. Let's start by, of course. Oh, gosh. Oh. Uh. <laughs> this moment. 
You must have been so proud. Look, he's crying. Oh, oh, no. <laughs> Isn't that just amazing? Look at you. Yeah, amazing moment. Oh. Oh, what's this about? Tell us about this moment. Gosh. That would have been probably a sound check at a gig, I think. No. It's mind blowing to see, you know, all that and how far we have come. Okay, look at this. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Probably your first gymnastics medal. Oh, yeah, really? I think one of the first gold medals. <laughs> Dad's support has never wavered. It's always been there, no matter what. <laughs> always will. <laughs> Was this one of your first gigs together? That's actually my brother's wedding. I would have been 10, 12-ish. Yeah. I just got up Look how Dad. proud Dad is looking yeah. at you. <laughs> I know. We really got to know them and all their moments and their memories so it can come back to the surface and they can put that in the song. So, the song that you guys are singing in the grand finale is... I've got goosebumps. It's <laughs> Alive by Sia. Oh, oh, my gosh. I love the song, but yeah. wow, it's a, that's a huge song. And then, obviously, the massive There's notes. There's some massive in notes in there. Yeah. That's it's huge. Big. Caitlin, I know you can do it. God, you can do it. <laughs> Just really commit to those high notes and don't forget to put all your emotions and experiences into this performance, yeah. all right? We are going to. Yes! <laughs> I was born in a thunderstorm. I grew up overnight. <laughs> I think they have a lot of potential to hit those high notes, to hit those really big moments. <laughs> That, that came out like so easy for you. Do that. I don't, you guys don't even need me. I'm leaving. I don't even need to be here. This is epic. Oh my goodness. Thank you. I honestly don't want to speak too soon, but like I honestly think we can win this thing. I can see it. I believe it. Yeah. And it's gonna be great. Yeah. I think this song is really gonna show Australia their strength and their courage and their fight. Being one performance away from winning a world first of the voice generations is just literally gives me goosebumps. Now that we've got this far, this competitive streak has just come out. I really want to win this now. Mm. For both of us. Yeah. Yes. Is singing with your daughter, Caitlin, is that a highlight in your life? 
absolute highlight. Every time that she, like, opens her mouth, just gets better and better. And I have to remember that I've got to sing as well. Because I, I find myself just... Like, you get a bit lost in the moment. I just get locked. I get locked on her and, yeah, she's just incredible, incredible. Wow, listening to the talent that she got from her dad. <laughs> Let's go over to the coaches. Guy. I think the other artists on Generations are now probably sitting backstage going, oh, <laughs> that was really good. And yeah. also, Tim... It's pretty obvious the apple doesn't fall far from the tree. That mm. was the first time that I was listening to you going, wow, dude can properly sing. Like, mm. you mm. you really nailed your part then. <laughs> I loved it. So, I, I, honestly, I think you guys just put yourself in contention to be the winners here because you, you yeah. smashed it. The winner of The Voice Generations 2022 is... Caitlin and Tim! Yeah.